this is the statue of Mr. Lenin. So this statue used to be on the other side where we saw Manas, but after the independence from the Soviet Union in 1991, they put Manas there, the real hero of Kyrgyzstan, and they put Lenin here on the other side of the museum. And I'm not sure what this building is, but it looks pretty important. Google Maps just told me that this is the government building of Kyrgyzstan. I already suspected something like that. That's exactly how it looks. We have the flag on top and we have this pretty impressive shield and the massive columns. To give you some context about Kyrgyzstan, the country consists for 90% out of mountains. They have a lot of lakes. There are only 6.5 million people in the whole country of Kyrgyzstan and one million of them are living here in the capital in Bishkek. There is a lot of Russian here and have their own language, the Kyrgyz, which is a kind of Turkic language. While we can see a little train passing by there, it's pretty funny. Kyrgyzstan is actually a landlocked country, which means they don't have access to the sea and they are surrounded by China, Kazakhstan, Uzbekistan and Tajikistan. This city is insanely calm and also very clean. That's definitely my first impression. So here we have the government building. In the back we can see kind of theme park with the Ferris wheel. And a huge boulevard, which is also kind of parking space here all around me. And we're going to enter this park here, which is called Dubovi Park. And Dub means oak because this park is full of oak trees and let's have a quick look at this huge poster these are the two fathers of the communism Karl Marx and Friedrich Engels and they have their own statue here in the oak park in Bishkek <laughs> This seems to be the hotspot that runs around this little fountain which isn't working at the moment. Plenty of people here. Look at these beautiful flowers. And we have this amazing building in the back. And people are driving around in their go-karts. And we have the party train again. Damn, there's another train. That's one, two, three trains. It's full of trains in this park. What a coolio! Yeah! Uh, super nice here, what a nice day in Bishkek. Hi! Thank, Thank you, you my friend. First let's have uh, some fresh water. I only took this little bag so I couldn't take my water bottle. 